On behalf of Office 24-7, I want to express my gratitude to all the people involved in the organization of this competition. We believe that this is the most interesting way of addressing the challenges of city areas like that of downtown Miami, and also learn from a wide variety of proposals. Office 24-7 is an international team currently scattered in a series of cities, so we certainly regret not being able to be present in the award ceremony and participate in the debate that will happen after these presentations. So on behalf of the team for this competition, I also want to thank Professor Goitze and Bernardo Brescia for their remarks. We have prepared a small video description of our project, hopeful that this enables some sort of debate. We hope that the audience finds it as exciting as we do, and we look forward to receiving and hearing any comments on our proposal. Our project explores the idea of a diaphragm, an interactive facade between the plaza and the Metro Mover station. A space that will change the experience of the visitor to the area for the two museums in Miami. We tried to produce a project of an iconic building, a building that will be recognized through your flow in the highway and through your flow in the Metro Mover. A building that connects to the different spaces in downtown Miami through a series of ramps connects the Metro Mover station to the plaza and to the spaces down by the Burlemark sidewalks. Our project is a proposal of an interactive facade that changes in their displays through the different moments of the day or the night. Projections can be made of science or art installations. Our project becomes an interior plaza, an interior landscape where the station is more than just a station, a place where you can watch interesting videos, installations, or sign this place. The connections for the plaza will enable the use of the metro station in a very proactive way. Hopefully, the plaza between the two museums becomes a new space within Miami for events and for a new kind of urban living.